Hey folks, Nick Corbertson here, and today I'm going to show you how to move the cube in Blender. Let's get started. So to start, just make sure your cube is highlighted by clicking on it. Then if you come over here to the side tab, I'm pointing at the side tab, you'll see the location, rotation, and scale. The only shortcut we're going to learn is hitting I. Push I, 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 as you have all of those highlighted, and that will set your keyframe down here on the bottom for the location, rotation, and scale. Now we're going to click here to change the length of this animation to 50 and click on another frame down here on our animations. Then come back over to your transform and move it around, just dragging these from the middle to whatever location you like. Uh, we're also going to rotate them 180 degrees and change the scale to 0 0.5, 0 0.5, 0 0.5, 0 0.5. Okay, then while you have these highlighted, just hit I, highlight the rotation, I and I. Aye, aye, sir. Then we'll come back down to our timeline and move to the 50th frame. And you can actually drag and highlight the first frame of the animation and paste it, and it'll bring you the same animation on that frame. But I wanna change my rotation to 360 degrees, that way it looks like it's doing a full turn. All right, now press I one last time, and hit spacebar, and there's our animation, a moving cube that is spinning around. You can click on the animation tab to see it a little bit better. The last thing I'll show you quickly is you can click down here on view and see the toggle graph editor. And from here you can drag all those points around to make something totally, totally wicked looking. Oh, dude. All right, Pixar, if you're hiring, call me. Now you know everything I know in Blender. Thanks for watching and I'll see you cube movers next time. Two minute video